This video is going to be on finding the range of a group of numbers. Finding the range. If we had a group of numbers, let's just make some up. 5, 7, 10, 19, 18, 3, and 6. What is the range of those numbers? Here's what you do, and this is the formula you can write down. The range equals the biggest take away the smallest. That is the range. I'm going to highlight that just so it's always there at the bottom. The range is the biggest take away the smallest. So in this case, let's highlight it. Perhaps not that color. I just want to make it really stand out. Range is biggest take away smallest, there we are. Let's actually look at our example. We have, what's the biggest number in our group? Our biggest number is 19. And what's our smallest number? Smallest number would be three. So what we do in this case is 19 take away three. 19 is the biggest, take away three, which is the smallest. And 19 take away 3 is 16. So the range is 16. Try another quick example. What about a bigger range? 82, 19, 81, 56, 55, 60, 71, and 24. What's the range here? Again, we need to find the biggest and then take away the smallest. The biggest would be 81, and the smallest would be 19. 81 take away 19 would be 62. Now, the maths of that, of subtraction, is not what I'm gonna focus on in this video. In this video, I just want you to remember that the range, range in real life just means the scope of something. So, in maths, it's the same thing. We have the scope of this group of numbers it means it's stretched all the way from its smallest, 19, to its biggest, 18. What is that range? So you might have a shooting range, which is all the way from one side of a field to another side. Well, the range in maths is just as important. It's the biggest number, take away the smallest. How about if I try to fool you by giving you a table of values. Let's see if you fall for my little trick. Inside this table, we're gonna have the goals scored in one game. Goals scored by different players in the Premier League, in Premier League, in one game. Okay, and the frequency. So frequency is just how many that number of goals was scored. So zero goals was actually 23 players. One goal was 16 players. Two goals would be five players, let's say. Three goals would be two players. And four goals plus was one player. Now all of that table, just to ask one question, which is, Find the range of goals scored. Of goals scored. Just before we do that, I'm going to need to tweak one little part of this just to make it a bit more fair. And that is that it was four goals exactly here. Four goals exactly was scored by one player. Right, what, find the range of the goals scored. You may be tempted to say 23 take away 1, but that would be the range of the frequencies. Actually, they just wanted the range of the goals. What was the biggest number of goals scored? It was 4. The smallest number of goals scored was 0. So all of that, when they ask for the range of goals scored, you would simply do 4 take away 0, which is 4. 
I hope you'll agree, range is actually quite a cute, fairly simple concept once you know how. The trick is remembering it. So range is biggest, takeaway smallest.